Hi guys, welcome to another video. How's your weekend going on? I hope you are having a great time. So this weekend we are heading towards a one night stay in a jungle resort. This is the place where we stayed. These are the hut houses. The, the stay was really beautiful. More on that is coming on the video. So just keep on watching. This property is listed in TripAdvisor. So I'm going to share that link in the description box below. So this is five to six hours journey from Bangalore. So we are on a road trip right now. And we have stopped for a cup of tea and some breakfast. This is a place called as Rang Rays. They have a nice beautiful interior. Let's see how their food is going to be. So this video is just to show you how was our experience and then we are going for jungle safari and all. So I'll just take you around. Stay tuned. Enjoy this video. We are done with the breakfast. We ordered a tea, coffee, a chola batura and some uh, parathas. The food over here is quite decent. I wouldn't recommend this place. In Zomato, I read some decent reviews about this place, but I did not, we or rather we did not like it that much. I am a tea lover and I did not like the tea over here, even though a lot of people have mentioned that tea is pretty decent, but I really did not like the tea. So I wouldn't recommend this place. Rather, uh, you can cr across the road, there is Kamat Lokaruchi. So you can go to Kamat Lokaruchi. At least you can enjoy a nice hot dosa over there. So yeah, that's a place to go. You can totally skip this place. I feel this is such a miss because it has such a beautiful sitting arrangement. Anyways, now it's time to hit back the road again. It will take us another 3-4 hours to reach the main jungle and then uh, we are going to go uh, further uh, and then after that we are going to go for safari probably enjoy a bonfire and then enjoy the morning in the jungle and then head back tomorrow so i'll just take you through the journey we are back on the roads so we have just reached nagarhul jungle Still, the main checkpoint is not coming. I just stopped at jungle for a moment, and it's so quiet and it's so nice over here. It's all birds are chirping around, and there's just calmness all around, so which is pretty nice. We'll see how the rest of the day goes. Now we are at the checkpoint, so the Nagar whole jungle starts from here. It started on a very dry note, but then the as we went inside, it became quite green, and we could see lot of uh, animals, especially the deers, they, they were like all around and I could, I also managed to take a selfie with them. Never miss a chance to take a good selfie. As we went further inside the jungle, the ride became quite exciting. It was full, full on greenery, a lot of animals we spotted in and around and the ride was so beautiful, it was so refreshing, we really enjoyed it. The jungle is over and we have reached Kutta. This is where our place of stay is. All now we can see around is just the coffee plantation. We have reached our place of stay. This is how it looks like. They have these beautiful hut houses over here. Let me just show you how it looks. It's a pretty interesting concept. This place is called as Turtle Pond and we found it on TripAdvisor. This is how the hut looks from inside. It was quite cozy and nice. And our hut has a small balcony facing the coffee plantation. So it's time to enjoy some coffee. And now it's time to enjoy the bonfire along with some wine. It's very beautiful out here. The sky is very clear. I can see all the stars. It's so cold. I wish I could show you all that, but, but I cannot capture that. So let me just enjoy the time. So that's how our bonfire is going, just enjoying the clear sky with all the stars and all the trees and nature all around. It's really very beautiful out here. It's really really beautiful. It's a lovely morning. Everything is looking so nice around. Just take a moment and enjoy the nature with me. Just listen to the sound of birds chirping around.
so today was a very beautiful morning we got up at 6:30 and then we went around the whole coffee plantation then came back had a nice breakfast and then just relaxed for the day and then in another one hour or two we will be leaving so the initial plan was that we wanted to go to uh, vari which couldn't happen yesterday because it was all booked so we just came back and relaxed over here yesterday's night bonfire was like amazing fun it was really 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 nice quite private and cozy because nobody else joined up so we were just we ended up listening to guzzles and then drinking our wine and then in sitting there for 3 4 hours and just chit chatting so it was very beautiful i if you come over here i would suggest you that do that as well property surrounded by coffee estate let me just show you how the property looks like it's a very beautiful property and it was really nice within the nature so we enjoyed the complete experience over here the food was pretty good and for a day or two i would suggest you to give this a try and the best part was the huts the hut houses so experience staying inside and then within the nature so if you just want to take a break if you just want to take a break come to this place it will take around 5 6 hours it's completely secluded so what you will see is only the birds chirping and nothing else which is a pretty good experience in itself just come here sit back relax enjoy some photography and then that's it let the time be so what you see behind me is all the coffee the uh, coffee plantation and then there is a small pond around and it's all very beautiful so these are your coffee beans this is how a coffee beans looks like this is pepper these are supari trees all around and that's my husband doing some photography over there Acha, this is a small pond that they have over here. I think that's what it's the property is named after. It's called Turtle Pond, and this is the surrounding campus. So again, some supari trees followed by the coffee plantation. So these these are the huts inside the property, and then this is completely surrounded by trees and nature or nature all around. So that was something which was a beautiful experience. Basically there's nothing much to do uh, but you can just come for a day or two and just relax and just be within the nature enjoy the whole journey throughout the jungle and the stay over here I hope you enjoy this video for more such videos uh, random videos or uh, what to do in and around Bangalore or, or what places to go on a road trip just stay connected I'll be back with more bye take care do share the video like subscribe comment and just spread some love so Take care till then bye bye